The Monarch Studio for the Performing Arts is providing students who have an eye on the arts an opportunity to learn about the practical side of this dazzling world. So we decided this year to start like intensive masterclass style week long, I mean programs. It's not really camp. Uh, we'll do some fun stuff, but uh, we thought with this wonderful team that we've sort of built over the last few years through the pandemic and artists who are really committed to um, lifting each other up and, and starting the, the connection for the youth in town, you know, mm -hmm. who haven't had an opportunity to be on stage in a few years now. Mm -hmm. um, we thought we would give them a practical experience and some really like on the ground, ground work in order to uh, to understand if the arts is really what they want to do in a really fun way at the Monarch. Davenport, who has had years of experience in this world, says she realized there was a big piece missing in setting up kids for success in the arts and entertainment industry on that practical level. Years ago, when I, when I actually was talking about running for a seat on council, mm -hmm. one of the things that I really felt was missing from our town is like a bridging program. We have all these incredible young people who want to be performers and artists. They go off to school, they get a degree in it, and they come back and there's no infrastructure here for them to succeed. Mm -hmm. And not that they're, it's impossible, but it makes it hard. And so if you don't understand the practical aspects of what it is like to be an artist, how to do a resume, how to do your taxes, how to get headshots, what happens when you graduate, when you don't have a job and you have a degree in the arts, how do you stay in the cities that you know are going to be where your main source of income is going to be, or how do you create your own income as an artist? Mm -hmm. You know, licensing your own shows, doing film work, commercial stuff, voiceover, how do you get into that? And so a big part of that for me, in my own experience as well, was that bridging moment of being a, a kid, going through college or an arts program, and then coming into adulthood and going, okay, what do I do now? Mm. So I figured, you know, learn from other artists. Artists teaching artists is the most important way we can collaborate together and build truly beautiful things and set our kids up for success from this town because we want to see our youth go off, be successful, and come back and reinvest that success into our community. So how can students get registered for this informative and fun program? So we're doing five weeks of summer camp in two age groups, so a 7 to 13 and a 14 to 18. The 7 to 13 will be more fun-based, music-based, dance-based, and the 14 to 18 will still have those elements, but we're going to add in a couple of the business stuff, the practicality of it, as well as headshots. They'll leave with a, di a real digital headshot for themselves so okay. they can actually go and look, start looking for agents if they want to and things like that, as well as we'll focus more on directing, producing, and stage management in that. And you can sign up through themonarchpas.com under the Summer Intensive Workshops.